Hey guys, and welcome back to another one of my videos. So if you always wanted to create your custom stickers on Telegram, today I'm going to be showing you how to do this and I'm going to take you through the entire process and how it's all done. Please note that I'm going to be on desktop on PC, but you can do the same thing on the phone and I'll give some tips on the phone as well. So without further ado, let's get into it. So before we start, the things you need are either Photoshop or Krita. In my case, I'm going to be using Krita because it's much more simple. You're going to need pictures. So of course, you're going to need transparent photos. Um, you can take these in VRChat. Uh, that is what I did. So you can go on VRChat and you can take photos there. I can I will show you how to do that as well. So if you already have photos, then you can skip to this part of the video here. That's when I start to add them in Telegram. If you don't have photos, then what I would suggest is you would go on VRChat, you would use the VRChat camera and you would use the filter to enable transparency and you would take a photo of either your face or your avatar, depending what you want. I recommend you to take your pictures in this VRChat world. It has the best lighting. And when you join the world, make sure you select the dark theme. So after you have those photos, what would you want to do is you want to go into Krita or Photoshop and you need to get a 512 by 512 uh, picture. I use Lightshot in my case, and I can just, by using the screenshot technique, I can just uh, set up a custom uh, resolution here, but you need 512 by 512 picture. So you would use this tool here and just erase it. And then usually what I would do is I would grab the picture that I want, insert it as a new layer, and then you use this tool here and you're going to be basically holding down shift and then holding the mouse one and resizing your picture inside of this uh, 512 by 512 picture, something like that. And then once you go back here, it's going to go back to its good resolution. Now, if you just want to keep the face, that is what I did in my case, you're going to again use the eraser and you're going to carefully erase part uh, that's not your body. There you go. And if you cropped your image, you can use this tool here to basically crop until you have desired look. And you're going to go file, save as desktop. And now you're going to save it as a PNG and just name it whatever you want. So once you have your pictures ready, now let's head to Telegram to set this up. So in Telegram, I'm going to have most of the portions blocked because, well, it is private and I don't want to just share everything. So don't mind that. But what you're going to do is go into the top this this search bar right here and you're going to type in stickers and you're going to be and you're going to go by this bot right here that says stickers and it's official bot. And once you message them, you're going to do slash start and Basically, it gives you an instruction here that you can follow. We're going to click new sticker pack. And once you do that, it's going to say a new sticker sticker pack has been created, what you want to call it. And then you're going to choose your specific name. And then that once you set a, a specific name now here, you see it tells you you need 512 by 512. So what you're going to do is you're going to take that photo that you just saved on your desktop, drag it in here, and you're going to drag it as a first option and then you're going to send it. Even if your image has white background, don't worry about that. You're not going to see that in the official stickers later on. So then after you did that, it is going to tell you what emoji do you want it to correspond to. So if it's a certain face, then you can use whatever emoji you want. It doesn't really matter. And then once you did that, the emoji is basically ready. It says, congratulations, your sticker is added. And then it's also going to, and then it's going to tell you to publish it. So you're going to publish after just selecting the first image, you can just do that. You're going to publish and then it's going to ask you for a name of the sticker pack and it's going to ask you for your sticker pack name. So just choose whatever you want. Uh, you can change this later on if you want to, but yeah. Now, of course, if you want to add more emojis, it's also very simple. You're just going to do slash add sticker and it's going to uh, it's going to tell you choose your sticker set. You're going to choose the one you created. And that's pretty much it. Then you do the same process again, again. I'm not sure what's the max amount of stickers you can have. I believe it's 30. But again, don't quote me on this as I'm, I don't use sticker that I don't use Telegram that much. But there you go. Now you have your own sticker pack. Of course, you can add pictures without transparent background, but it just makes it nicer when you have a image that's a transparent background. Now, if you're on a phone or a mobile device, then you're going to be using another bot. So once you have your photos, you're going to type in easy sticker bot. So A Z sticker bot. It looks something like this. 
and you're basically going to do again slash start and you're just going to follow its instructions and what does it tell you. Basically how it works is you're going to send it a photo that you want and it's going to send you back a specific photo of basically a copy of that photo and you're just going to forward that photo onto the sticker bot and there you go. That should work. Hope that this video helped you guys out. Let me know that in the comments if you have some questions and yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you around. Peace.